so you wanted to create a widget system like this one so if i click this one it will take me to this widget and if i click go to menu it will bring back to this main menu widget so you want this okay let's get started uh, first we will open up a new project so if i play this one you see this is a normal one widgets are popping up so yeah so we need to create the widgets i'll create a new folder called ui here i will create user interface i uh, widget blueprint user widget so i will call this wbp widget blueprint underscore main menu or i think yeah main menu would be good uh, another one should be uh what should i call settings menu wpp underscore settings i guess okay uh, the last thing we want is a parent one parent so let's go so let's create a simple main menu create a let's just take a canvas panel uh 1980 by 1000 yeah 1920 into 2080 then i'll take a text box text sorry text and create okay i'll call it main menu font i'll increase the font like this okay then let's create a button so this is the button we will center this out i will increase the button size and i will get a text inside the button so the text will be yeah we need to increase the font yeah okay so this is the setting uh, this is it okay let's create the settings one same canvas panel okay we can copy the button from here and paste the button here okay so we can just simply call it main menu okay let's go to the graph editor of main menu i will remove everything then i will okay i will take this settings button settings button on click then i need to create a variable and the class will be widget switcher and the class will be widget switcher compile go to the settings take the button on click remove everything same create a variable the class will be widget switcher compile now go to the parent create a canvas panel down to yeah 1920 into 1080 take a widget switcher anchor will be fill the screen offset will be zero zero then we need to do we just dock it first get the main menu to the widget switcher then get the settings to the widget switcher compile save now go to the main menu um now get get this one set active um yeah the, get the switcher one not the variable get the switcher set active widget index so yeah so we need to go to from this menu to the settings i mean to the settings from the main menu to settings okay i will change the color 
okay this is settings change the button color also so that yeah so red one is the settings so we need to click this one to go to this menu so okay so if i take the widget switcher and if i go to the active widget index it is zero now so it is on this window if i put it one it will go to settings put it zero again so we need to put it into one okay so put the number one compile save and from the settings to main menu we need we need to go to one to zero so yeah on the button click you get this one get set active widget index so it would be zero compile save now go to the parent graph remove everything get a event construct um okay let's get this switcher get the switcher get the main menu and get the settings okay from the main menu get widget yeah get oh no sorry sorry set widget menu switcher okay set widget menu switcher from the main menu connect this connect this with the widget switcher and from the settings set widget yeah this one set widget setting switcher get this one connect this one and connect the widget switcher to the widget switchers widget setting switcher okay now why i can't drag this one okay so it is more neat and clean okay now compile save so how can we test our widget so there's an easy way to debug our widgets so if we go to our uh, it is in here level blueprint I uh, ignore this this is just some ready player made stuff going on oh you need the ready player made so you need ah uh, you can just debug it just connect the begin play and then okay i will show you the simplest way i'll disconnect this one win begin play create widget Uh, select the class parent select the parent class now right click this one promote to variable call it parent something i don't know uh, then just add to viewport compile save run the game here it is main menu if i click the settings it will get you to the settings menu if i click the main menu again it will bring back to your main menu. okay congratulations